As you can see, I am tired. I'm not. So we are heading to the Museum of Natural... I can't really see you. <laughs> we are heading to the Museum of Natural History. And with... Yay. Oh, with Nikki and John. Woo! From Nikki and John's vlogs. Woo! Ooh. We get to see Nikki's big baby belly. She's 31 weeks. I'm sleepy. Okay, we'll see you when we get there. So did you watch our vlog, Nikki, where Kevin was checking his eyebrows? I didn't see that one, no. And I just had to tease him and I said, they look better than Nikki's. You guys gotta, gotta stop with this. I, seriously, I have an eyebrow complex. My eyebrows don't grow evenly, and so like I'm always checking. You know, one is just like naturally a little higher than the other. My face is in perfectly symmetrical. Oh, yeah. I don't notice it. They look fine. They look even. They're not. But then like people on YouTube would comment like, "Oh, her eyebrows look weird and stuff like that." And it gave me like a weird complex about my eyebrows. So I'm like always checking if my eyebrows look good and stuff, and I'm trying to. You know, grow them out and I go to like fancy schmancy eyebrow bars. The regular eyebrow brow bars. The brow bars? How is that regular? Because I get them threaded? Well, I get them threaded, I mean. Which is supposed to be but your eyebrows look beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> and John's picking out his eyebrows right now. Don't look at me. I'm hideous. <laughs> Openings in the butterfly pavilion. You get butterflies to land on you. You get butterflies to land on you like the birds did. No way. I got that's Yes, but you had a pet bird for a long time. Not a best friend. I wonder if we go back there if that same bird would remember John. I know, I got squirted on in my hair. So, Megan, butterflies. we are at the Museum of Natura Natural History. Butterflies. Butterflies. Is there anything else you want to see while you were here? Obviously, dinosaurs. Maybe they have a dinosaur pavilion. <laughs> There's some strange man standing behind you. It's a giant. It's a giant. <laughs> Step into the map, John. Step into the map. <laughs> All sorts of stuff in here. Well, we need to go to the butterfly thing at four. And there's some meet and greet thing or something at three. At three. Where you get to pet an animal. Megan never gets to pet animals. Nope. It's probably gonna, if it's something that I already have, it's silly. If it's a tortoise or a rat, not interesting. There's a wide variety of animals that you could potentially have already pet that they can have. We are in the hall of African mammals, right? The first animal we are going to see is a very, very rare Hippopotamus. Hippo. 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 I don't want to talk to it anymore. It's annoying. Hello, friend. It's staring at me like it knows something. That's pop pop. Oh, I'm zoomed in really much. <laughs> I want to ride you. Look at the baby. I think so, yeah. Pretty. Do you, do you want to ride an elephant? Always.
I don't know how well you guys can see this, but this one's cool. It's, it looks like it's like see-through, like it's jelly. Like I can stick my mm -hmm. finger right through it. Yeah, it looks like um, like kind of a jello cake or something that you stick fruit into. Yeah, and then like there's like weird cloudy parts inside of like that orange that looks, I don't or know. Soap. Soap, soap yeah. with stuff in the middle. Soap with stuff in the middle. <laughs> okay, so this looks soft. <laughs> but it's probably not. It's usually how it goes. Idea. Well, that's usually how it goes with rocks, Megan. <laughs> I never thought of it like that. <laughs> it does look soft. It does. It, it looks, looks like fluffy, like, like cotton yeah. balls. Megan, did you see this one? No, wait, stay up there and put the map away and the camera away and pose as art pieces. That's what I'm doing. I'm going to have modern museums. It was going real loose, but there was nothing in the bottom, and there was just going straight. Striking the pose. Big fat pregnant lady. Okay, next pose. Okay, let's go to the next exhibit. Short on time. I want to go to that wolf sanctuary. How old? We should go. Is your inner wolf coming out? Yes. Do it again. You got other people oh. howling with you. Oh. making friends with this one's pretty butterflies John thank you for cooling me off it is so hot in here I went to the doctors the other day yeah and they needed to get my exact height I've always told the doctors I'm five foot because I'm 4'11 and three quarters yeah 
In a black and white world, that's not five foot. Well, they needed my exact height, so they made me take my shoes off and stand to get measured. I'm 4'10 and two thirds. Mm, yeah, pretty short. I've shrunk. That's okay. I'm only 6'2 and a half, so I can't tell people that I'm 6'3. I'm 6'3 with my shoes on. But I shrunk. That happens when you get old. I'm not old. I'm not. <laughs> I didn't, you're old, getting older. John just called me old. You? He does? Yes. Oh, no. He says, that's what happens when you get old. Why, what, what happens? I used to be 4'11 and 3 quarters. I am now 4'10 and 2 thirds. So I shrunk. And John said, that's what happens when you get old. <laughs> I do know you shrink with, as you age. I don't know how soon. Maybe, maybe it's a little premature for you. <laughs> <laughs> I was just filming Megan and following her, and she just slammed the camera shut on me. There's a problem. Oh, there's one. What's the problem? You found a polar bear. My ancestors. I'm coming home. You're scaring children, mother. <laughs> Nikki's favorite. It's, that's a whip scorpion. That's not even a regular scorpion, but it's creepy enough to give anyone nightmares. Jessica, it was Michael's that we were in. And she said she is not surprised that Megan and I are not banned from stores in general. Stores in general. I keep waiting for that. It'll probably save me a lot of money. <laughs> but we are pretty sure that whenever we go into one store in particular... I'm not going to mention it. Um, the, the, um, the workers... Security follows her around. It's not security. It's not security. It's the, it's the regular employees. Uh. And you know how when you go into a store and you need help and you have to try and track somebody down to ask a question well we don't ever have to track anybody down at Home Depot they're always right behind me <laughs> so yes it is Home Depot and they keep a pretty close eye on me after my trip in the uh, the cart yeah so anyway Sammy and Ear, um, I guess you could say I have a high pain tolerance since I am in pain constantly and I don't take anything for pain. Um, this, the only thing I'm actually allowed to take due to many medical issues is Tylenol. And I try and take a little as, of that as possible. So, yeah. I do have a high pain tolerance, I would say, but I cried very hard when she tattooed my foot. And no, many people guessed the San Remo Hotel, but it's not the San Remo Hotel. We did do the San Remo Hotel in 2005, and we still want to go and transfer all those 
um, investigations from 2005 to from the high eight to video to put them up onto our YouTube channel like we did with the Brookdale Lodge so you guys can all see those. So, no, sorry, not the Sam Remo, but good guess. Same state. Yeah. KMP wanted me to give a shout out to Tina. So shout out to you, Tina. And I have an Etsy account I'd like you guys to all go by and check out. It's Etsy.com slash slash forward slash <laughs> shop forward slash Myron Avenue Design. And it's M Y R O N Myron A Avenue Designs. Designs. Go check it out. Lots of handmade beautiful stuff on there. Go check it out. And Whitney from Arizona sent me a message on Instagram. She said she watches our vlogs every night. So, hope you're watching, Whitney. Um, she wants, to, wants me to go and watch her vlog, but I don't know what your YouTube channel is. If it is the same as what your Instagram is, I couldn't find it. So... Let me know how to find you on YouTube, and I'll be happy to do that. Um, you also wanted to know how old our dog and our cat was. Freckles is our dog. He is going to be nine in December. And which cat are you talking about? We have six. But thanks, Whitney, from Arizona. And we had a new addition to the Neighborhood Community Shout Out! And it's your turn to start. I did it last night. Kimmy, you didn't tell me. I don't know. Kimmy, I, I need help. I did it last night. Start. Jack Adams. Katie Caroline. Lucy Bluebones. Daniel Scott. Christopher Trade Show. Uh, Clay Bed with usernames. Selena G. Love, 487, also known as Brian. Tom Shayu. Rex, 25059. ZZ Epic Dude ZZ. Dana Besaw. Uh, Beauty Queen, 12. Marin Brenda Smith. Daphne Sheehan. Lucy and Autumn. Samantha L. Domestic Goddess. Alien K18, Kimmy. Destiny Hall. Sammy Anair. The Abyss 92882. Meet the Presleys. Hey there, Sarah. Charlene Higdon. Skylar Chantel, Shaylee, and Shane. Ah, uh, you, you did that on last night, so we did it wrong. And the newest member to the Neighborhood Community shout out is Ground Dome. Ground Dome. Ground Dome. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it was not for all of you. Thank you. We love you all. Thumbs up, and we'll see you tomorrow.